Previously on Resident Evil 4. <laughs> ah, boy, sure is nice to get away for a change. How long has it been? Five, maybe six years since my last holiday? I hear rural Europe's really nice this time of year. Oh, an email. Uh, from Claire? No, no, relax, Leon. I can wait. Hello, Mr. Kennedy. I would like to ask you a question. Uh, Hunnigan, come in. I was wondering if you could find me a new holiday destination. You've received some items from Ashley. Ah, oh, of course, of course. Because in the previous pod, we were playing as Ashley, and wasn't that a joy? Wasn't that a comb- No, fuck. I can't remember to do this, uh, bear with me a sec, it has been, uh, <laughs> about six weeks, right? Six weeks, maybe? Oh, right, backspace, that's it, yeah. And I'm terribly sorry about that. I am terribly sorry about that. Now, yeah. Huge delay. Mainly because, um, well, I've had a few technical issues, been ill, but otherwise, um, I planned to kind of get some of this recorded before Extra Life started. That did not happen. And, um, yeah. Now you guys want to kill me. I'm pretty sure about that. Can I combine that in? Would that be... Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right, that's, that's perfect. Oh, we can expand our health bar by combining this into one of the green herbs, or maybe a mixture. That might work. I haven't tried that yet, have I? Hmm. Okay. Let's, uh, start with chapter... Four? Ah, oh, what a touching moment we have here. Hello, oh, ugly. Spoiled thanks to your interruption. Why don't you do us all a favor and leave before the audience gets pissed off? Bye bye, subtitles. <laughs> You're nothing but an extra in my script, so don't get too carried away. Your biggest scene is over. I don't ever remember being a part of your crappy script. Well then. Why don't you show me what a first-class script is like, through your own actions? I'm sorry, but the villain seemed to outwit Leon every single time in this game. He just doesn't- he doesn't have a good sense of humor, it seems. How the fuck do I play this game? Hmm. Yeah. Uh, new chapter, of course. Enemies are gonna be absolutely fucking everywhere. And I need to take Ashley all the way back to that star that was- where exactly? Do I need to take her back to this? I thought there was a place I needed to lift her into. Did I imagine that? No, no, no. It was over here. This is where the um, the fountain was with the crows just over it and whatnot. Oh, oh my god. There's a few places that we're going to pass through to get there. Which I'm not looking forward to checking out. And, well, we should just pretty much go everywhere. Now, I had a little bit of practice off screen. I did the whole village segment again just to make sure I wasn't too rusty for when I play with you guys again. Uh, oh, God, rest in peace, buddy. No one's cleared that body up yet. Uh, can we, can we... Yeah, okay, still the same thing. Uh, it might be a good idea to talk to our merchant friend before we do, you know, anything else, I guess. Oh, no one down here, that's good. We did pick up a few things as Ashley, actually, which uh, we may benefit from. Not sure, but what's new in this menu? Apparently something was, but don't see anything new. Great. That's 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 wonderful. What tune up. Can we tune anything up? And we can tune up the mine thrower and increase, increase the capacity and thus refill it. That was something I wanted to do, wasn't it? Uh, we have two bullets left, though, so we may as well not do that just yet. And also, should probably equip something different to what I have equipped at the moment. I do want to be careful, though, because um, we don't have a lot of ammo left. And also, we have Ashley with us. Who? How, how do you control Wait. her again? You press Z, don't you? Follow me. Yeah, that works. Well, let's head through. And Oh, what do you know? Doesn't seem to be anyone here. That's a surprise. We can just go straight through there, can't we? And go back to the previous area, I believe. I'm kind of nervous at the moment, though. Um, very much nervous, actually. Oh, God, yeah, we've got to catch Ashley. Wait, what? Where'd she go? Oh. Why go all the way to the ladder? Come on, you've been lazy. Right, you wait there, because apparently there's a vase or two here that wasn't there before, I think. Some shotgun shells. Uh, wait, no. There's only one. Okay, that's fine. That's no problem. Might pay to inspect everywhere, then. Just in case there's some items here and there. Ashley will follow me up anyway, won't she? So, it's fine. But, uh, yeah. 
keep a lookout, see if the if we can see any like um wait a moment. This moves on to another area. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. I um wait what? Oh yeah, you pass straight through this area, don't you? So there's yeah, no, I remember, I remember you had to move the bridge over to the side, didn't you? Is there any um of our items around here? I'm not looking forward to going in there, by the way, because you know the side guys are dangerous. They throw the scythes and they hurt. And sometimes you can avoid them, but they'll probably hit Ashley in the face, and that's not something we want to see, is the... <laughs> no, no, no. Right. Hi, buddy. Um, you know what? I'm not going to waste much time with this. I'm just going to shoot one of these with this, like so. And then, if we just run away... Right. Wait. Are there any other enemies, or is it just this guy in the cage? I hope it's just this guy in the cage. Because I'm going to go wrestle him now, and Ashley better be- What the fuck? What? I thought he was inside- Excuse me? I thought you were inside the cage. You're clearly not, though. Stay the fuck down. He must have been on the other side. That really confused me. Hmm. Right, so, uh, they dropped a couple of items for us. Let's pick those up. Got some more money. They seem to be dropping a lot of money now in comparison to, you know, what they were before. I thought I heard something else moving then, but I think it was Ashley. And is there anywhere else we can go in here? There is the other side of the... Oh, we might be able to get a sneak peek of what's ahead of us through here, actually. Any enemies? No, it doesn't look like it, actually. I think we're pretty safe. To be honest, with the back backtracking that we did on Chapter 2, I believe it was, there wasn't a lot of enemies around, was there? Oh, hang on, there's a couple at the end of the... Right, okay. Um, Wait. Tell you what, Ashley... Oh, shit. Yeah, there's one down here. I thought there was. Shit, we better take him out. Oh, fuck. Of course, he has the, um... Shit. Um, the helmet on. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. I shouldn't be panicking. Panicking's probably gonna get me killed. Damn it. Of course, we can do the suplex. Um, that's on the other side of Ashley, though. That's not good. Oh, shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Please let me suplex you. No, you're not going to let me suplex you. Fuck. Just, just stop panicking. It's probably for the best. Ashley, do you want to, like, not get... Okay, yeah, you're going to go ahead and do that. There we go. Problem solved. You stay down as well. I probably should have just done that in the first place. Yeah, panicking far too much at the moment. I wasn't expecting there to be so many... Go Wait, f f mind darts? That's the first time we found them on an enemy. Is this guy dead? Yes, he is. Right. Uh, kind of begs the question, should I go back through the other areas, or should I just keep proceeding through the way I'm going at the moment? We have plenty of pistol ammo, at least, don't we? Hmm. Yeah, I tell you what, I'm going to go round the hard way and actually inspect everything again, just to see if we... That said, I really don't want to go into the garden again. Didn't like the garden. That said, we, we really don't need to, you know, like, go into the garden. We can just take a look at it. Well, Follow me. Oh, right, she wasn't following me. We can just take a look at it. We can just look at it from a distance away, you know, and be like, there's nothing there, I don't need to go there, so it's fine, you know. Does that sound logical? It does to me. Oh, what? I thought there was a door there. There clearly isn't. We have the typewriter here, may as well save the game. Now, that said, I think I'll go talk to the merchant first. Nothing's changed, still useless, whatever. Just wasting time. Right, let's save the game. Here. I can save it there. Has anything spawned here at all? I'm, I don't really want to, like I said, don't want to go down to the garden. I just don't like the dogs. I think they're kind of, um, like how much health we lose fighting the dogs as well. It just doesn't really, it's not worth it. It's not worth it is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, it really isn't worth it. Right, so this was a little bit fruitless, I think. Yeah, because we're on the other side now, aren't we? Whatever, it doesn't matter. Nothing's really spawned here, unfortunately. Have any of the crows, maybe? Nope. Still no crows. Any enemies here? That could be a problem. No, I don't really like it. And, yeah. We need to get Ashley to go up there, don't we? I think. How do- wait, what? I thought. Is that not the case? Um... It won't open. It's locked from the other side. Yeah. But, 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 but... Oh, there we go. Right. 
Go on, up you go. There's much treasure in there and we need it. We definitely need it. Whoa, 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 what the fuck was going on with the skirt then? Should I even, uh, uh, like, ask that question? That was just magical. Right, oh wow. That is a lot of money. And what's in the next one? A red, wow. A red herb, that is better than any treasure. Oh. Wait. No. No. Fucking. Oh, whatever, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. What's, what the fuck is that? Elegant perfume bottle. Ashley, do you want to smell nice? No, no, okay, never mind. Uh, fucking bastarding thing. I even said, like, I, I had a, I had a slight suspicion that maybe we find one of these, but you know, I thought the game wouldn't do that to us. It really, really wouldn't do that to us. Surely it wouldn't. Uh, it's done it to us. It's done it to us, guys. Fucking piece of shit. Right, where are we going now then? I mean, there's many places we can backtrack to, but is there any point? I don't think there is really, is there? I mean, I, I really, really don't remember being able to get into any other areas. Wait a moment, submission is still down there? Okay, that's a bit weird. I might head back there and check it out, just in case, you know, there's another target range that we need to do. But I somewhat doubt that's the case. Now, bizarrely, the game wants us to go back there. What? Why does it want us to go there? Huh? I thought that there's like so many other pla- Oh, right, because of course we got the- Yeah, never mind, I'm being an idiot. We got the uh, remainder of the Chimera, haven't we? So. What do we want to do? What do we want to do? I mean, it might be worthwhile going into that room. That's so we can just pass through it to uh, from the, um, the room with the submission anyway. So yeah, I think I'm going to head in that direction. You guys can join me if anything happens, of course. I really doubt there's going to be many enemies about, though. Watch, like, some of the areas that I've been to and they've been 100% fine be completely populated with enemies or something like that, you know. It's actually not with me. There's no need to go back. Oh. Right. We can't go any further back, guys. Good to know. So, I guess we'll just head in the opposite direction. Well, I mean, I may as well have a chat to the merchant to get rid of the other broken butterfly. I don't think I have a use for two of them. I'm guessing if, uh, yeah, I sell the cheaper one. That's the one I need to get rid of. Here's a question. How much did we buy the boat broken butterfly for? Because it better be, like... Ah. Uh, yeah, I've really lost out there. Well, never mind. Right, where do we want to go from here? I mean, there's three different doors we can go through. Judging by the fact that this area is red... No, actually, no. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I think we've got to go that way, haven't we? But we can also get down by going through this other trail that Ashley went through previously. I wonder if there's going to be anything there. I'll tell you what, let's check out the door, shall we? I mean, we can always turn around and go the other way anyway. And um, plus, actually, this leads off to a place that we've never been before. Uh, hang on, what's this all about? Oh, this takes us right the way back to the entrance. Ah, I think we're supposed to go that way, aren't we? You know what? Never mind, let's go to the... Let's go the way that Ashley came from. Yeah, let's go that way first. I don't know if there'll be any enemies around, but... Oh, there's no need to go back. Okay, so never mind, the game is forcing us in this one direction. So we've got to go this way. There's also a typewriter on the other side of this door, so I really doubt anything harmful is going to be there, but I could be wrong. What the fuck? Uh... Wait! Okay. What's the deal with this place? Why... Oh, thank you. Why is, uh... Well, it's really nice looking for a start, but, um... Why is this something... I said wait! Can she not? There's... Oh, this really doesn't look safe. Like, fucking hell, this is something I expect to be in a Castlevania game, not Resident Evil. Huh. Um... I guess we've got to go over there. And, oh, right, okay, we can get to the other side and go to an area that has some kind of secrets. This is some sub-objective, isn't it? It's a sub-objective whereby we've got to go across there and, um... Across that very highly dangerous area with lava just under it. 
We're probably going to get killed somehow. And go and retrieve that item. How well is this going to go? How well is this going to go? Can I not leave Ashley here? No, she's got to come with us, hasn't she? Oh no, never mind. What the fuck? Well, hopefully she's going to be alright. I mean, it seems like the game is going to actually keep her protected while Leon goes on this little adventure on his own. I hope that's the case. I really, really do hope that's the case. What the fuck is this? Oh, this almost feels like a setup. Like something really dangerous is going to happen. And we need to avoid it in order to um, get over to... Why the f... I want to know why the fuck. Oh, Jesus. What the hell's going on down there? The fire in this room has done really well. And then the um, the fire-breathing objects that we first encountered, like, when we... Oh. Right, okay. Oh. Uh, and that's coming over here. What? Did that just break? Why is that slowly rotating towards me? I'm not- I'm not seeing things right. That is- that will- that did just slowly rotate to face me. Or close enough, anyway. It sounds like it's still trying to rotate. But having a tr a bit of trouble doing so, if you get what I mean. I don't feel safe. Really don't feel safe. It's looking at me. It's definitely looking at me. But it's not manned, so we should be safe, right? I'm guessing I've just got to jump on this at the right time, but... Oh, no, that's right above there. Huh. Oh, God, right. Just get off there quick. Come on. That works. Just run. Whoa, shit. Fuck. I knew that was going to happen. Right, I need to, um... Oh, God, yeah, that breathes fire. That was lucky. I had a feeling something like that was going to happen. And it very much did... Whoa, 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 what's going on? There's definitely fire here, but, um, no, you don't. Your friend's still alive, I know he is. Oh, shit. I don't go any further forward because of that thing breathing fire, and I tell you what, I really need to heal myself, really need to heal myself, because these guys are doing crazy damage. Like, really crazy damage. Can I mix it with... Yes, I can. And then mix it with... Ah, oh, okay, that works. Ah, full health recovery, cool. Okay, let's, um... Can't combine any inventory. I want to, but I know I can't. What the hell is going on? I know it's trying to breathe fire on me, but I don't know if it's like firing it at the wall and missing me entirely. It must be. It really, really must be. Is there anywhere I'm like missing in this split? No. What? Why is there... It says the star is here, but there's nothing there at all. What the fuck's this all about? Huh. Odd. Well, guess I should just wait for the fire to stop and then get a move on away from here. Now, uh oh. Here comes another, I guess. And where the fuck is this? Good question. Oh, really now? Like, right in front of me. And another enemy, right. Yeah, you come over here. I'm not going over there. You, you can be the one who gets doused in flames. Yeah, have fun with that. You don't seem to be affected by it, do you? Nope, you're getting back up. Right, sure, why not, I guess. I guess they remember their fire immunity armor, because I most certainly didn't. Stay down. Just die, will you, please? What the fuck? You get- no, okay, he's dead, he's dead. This one hasn't got head armor on, has it, so... Yeah, probably should have done that sooner. Dead? No, there's still more. And I really want the ammo, if that's okay. Can I maybe... Yep. Why am I doing this when I got my knife? Oh, Jesus. This is bad. Um, right. No, not rocket launcher. Rocket launcher would not help in this situation. Pretty sure of that. Stay away. Yeah, no. I know what you're about to do to me. You're not doing it. Right, do you want to get over here, buddy? Um... 
Trust me, it's safe. You really don't have to worry about the fire. Any more? Oh, God. It's like they're coming forever. Oh shit, there's a there's one on the other side, isn't there? I forgot about that. Fuck. Shit. Um I need to kind of get away from here. Yeah. We're not safe on that side at all. Oh you fuck. I want that. Maybe I should actually think about doing something about this, you know. Uh, on the other hand, I, I really don't know what to do at all. I mean, you can might kind of make distance and then, um... Oh, for fuck's sake, again? Try my absolute best to, um... Oh, I've dealt with that, I guess. Um, try my absolute best to try and pick it off or something, the sniper. That might work. But I've got to be really, really careful. Like, really careful. Still not dead? What the fuck? Thank you. How many more of these guys are gonna come? For fuck's sake, hurry up. No, that was a miss. How many bullets to the ass can you take? Right, I think we're safe now. Pretty sure we're safe. Just gotta be careful. Like, wait for that one to shoot. And then I think it's good. We can... no? Hmm. I think it's only the fire from that one that's dangerous. Looking at things. Huh? I'm getting really confused. Like, where the hell are these things? Is it just the one that's on the left? Is that it? Or is it? I thought it was something to do with this one. It's not. Is it? Oh god, I'm getting really confused by this. Like, really confused. No, no, it is that one as well. Shit. Ah, yeah, that guy- that one's actually manned, I didn't realise. So what I need to do is I need to lure it over there. Run as far down there as possible and then run back, and hopefully I should kind of, like, bait it over here so I'm able to deal with it. Just wait for it to kind of poke its head round the corner and then move out the way quickly. Here it comes. Nope, nothing. Decided not to bother. Oh shit. No, it's still moving, fuck. Ugh. Oh, for fuck's sake. Alright, move, move, move. Right. Get down here quickly. Shit. Right, now turn around. Should be able to see him from here when it turns. There we go, perfect. Right, so that's another one down. Now we just need this one other here. How the fuck am I going to deal with this? I've taken a fair bit of damage from these bastards. Oh, nice red brooch, lovely. It's the Illuminados pendant again. Well, we know when it, um, when it fires, it kind of shoots from left to right, so we have a little bit of... No, we really don't. We need to kind of get at an angle. Maybe over here, I can see it. No, it seems to have adjusted itself. Has it? Oh. Huh. I really don't know how the fuck I'm going to do this. I mean, I could toss a grenade over there. I don't think that's going to work out, though, is it? Can I maybe shoot it from one of the sides? Nope, it's facing this way. Fuck. Maybe if I go to the other side quickly. I can't see, though. No, I really can't see. Fuck. It's because of the way the camera goes over Leon's... Yeah, there we go. Right. Brief fire there. Right, let me go over the other side. See, it's much easier to see from this side. Oh, there we go. Dealt with that. I think this is what nightmares look like. Uh, no sound at all for that clip. Didn't need it. Right. Okay, there we go. I think I've done it all. That wasn't so hard. Oh, we needed to come here anyway. We needed to get this uh, final piece of the ornament. Fair enough. Right. Are we safe to just leave? Ah, right. Okay. So the, the extra item that was there. Yeah. 
I just need to get across here safely. There we go. It was optional. It was an optional item. I didn't realise. Right. I thought we had all three pieces. I actually got one. Leon got the one, the other one much earlier on. And then of course this is the third one. Am I missing anything in here? It doesn't look like it, does it? I'm happy to ditch this place. Very, very happy to ditch this place. Right, let's get back over. We can save the game. So that was a job well done. Took a fair bit of damage, like I said, so that's probably going to cause the difficulty of this place to drop quite a fair bit, but, you know, not complaining. I could really do have a bit of lower difficulty, especially, like, based on how much damage the enemies are doing. It's fucking insane. So, all we got to do now is go down here, and I have no idea what to- what the fuck. Oh god, is this going to be, like, some sort of, uh, spooky house kind of thing going on? We don't have many herbs left. Holy crap. I have uh, gone through quite a lot quite quickly. And I'm really worried about my health as well. It's not grace at the moment. I mean, um, judging by the number of times we got hit, I don't think the enemies will be doing a, a particularly large amount of damage. But, you know, I need to be kind of careful, don't I? I don't know how safe this is going to be. I really doubt it's going to be that safe. Or I could be completely wrong. It could be perfectly safe. What? Why didn't Salazar, like, decide to rig this with explosives or something down- Do you want to move away from me just so I can break these? You know, something down the lines of that? I don't know. Put enemies down the track so you have to have a bit of fun shooting them as you're rolling around. And we're just back in this room, we're good. Ah, oh, you unlocked this, cool. Now is this room going to be safe? It's a good question. No, it is. It's perfectly safe. And I wonder if we can do any backtracking from here. Might be worthwhile. Might be. I really doubt it somewhat, though. Yeah. We'll try the door on the right first. If that doesn't work, we could try going the other way. Ah, oh, we can open this. Of course, this was, a. Uh, it wasn't its own instance, though, was it? It was just a uh, part of the other areas. Why has that chair been knocked over? Uh, is our friend down there gone? I don't remember if he dissolved or not. He wasn't too friendly, was he? No, he seems to be gone entirely. Yeah. Alright, let's go back to, uh... Oh god, do we really have to go down here? Kinda scared, actually. Wait a moment, that painting looks suspicious. Ah, here we go. Of course, it'd be one of those that has a, uh... Something hidden behind them. I mean, we did discover that quite later on, didn't we? His horse is on breathing fire, that's good news. Oh, it's this sexy guy again, I forgot about him. God. Uh, he looks a little bit like Cap Captain Hook, if he was really sexy. Yeah. Let's roll with that, shall we? There's no need to go back, okay, so this is a point of no return. At least I got a bit of money from coming down here. Uh, I'll keep my eye out for paintings, because, like I said, I only just figured out that that was a thing. Oops, sorry, just whacked my microphone there. Uh, there was loads of paintings in here, wasn't there, actually? I think. Or did I... No, there was a lot of windows, actually. Not paintings, not paintings at all. Oh, we can get back out here, that's a surprise. The fuck, why do we want to come this way, then? Why would we want to come this way? Wait! Actually, just wait right there. No, there's absolutely nothing at all. And we can still keep on going back. What the fuck? Oh god, this room. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, having I mean, uh, even more flashbacks now. I just remembered, um... Recently I decided to check out the demo of Code Madman, which is based on the the E3 2003 trailer of Resident Evil 4. If you've never seen it before, I suggest checking it out. But, um, I think I mentioned this before. It was going to be originally going to be a much more horror-based game than how this game actually turned out. Boy, and yeah, the, boy. um, the Code Madman, it's based on that, essentially. It's like a fan remake of how the game probably would have been. And Come yeah, it actually included this dark. room. It actually included this room, and, um... It was, it was pretty terrifying. It was pretty terrifying, to say the least. I can really backtrack here. Why can we? Is there any point at all? Is there anything that I missed? So yeah, if you want to check that out, um, it's up on my page. It's up on my page. I did it as a live stream. It's part of Extra Life, actually. It's a charity event that I did. It was a lot of fun. 
I'll also include it as part of the uh, Resident Evil 4 playlist, as it kind of is relevant. Well, there's no going back that way. So why is this open? Why didn't they just lock it off like everything else? Is it to benefit those who like got the map later, maybe? Or something like that? I don't know. I really don't have a clue why they would do this. Oh, cool little thing as well, actually. I got a, um... I got a message on the video... Uh, the, the post-stream, should I say, of Code Madman from one of the developers of the game. And he says it is still currently an ongoing project, so I'm looking forward to playing the full game whenever that's released. I'm really looking forward to it. I've been kind of delving into a lot of um, Resident Evil side projects and whatnot lately. There's a lot of things that are worth looking at. If you didn't know recently as well, I did um, I did a playthrough of the Extreme Battle Mode on Resident Evil 2, which is exclusive to the DualShock version of it. Never heard of it before until like about three years ago, didn't even know it existed. But you get to play as Chris Redfield and Ada, it's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Rock hard as well, the hardest classic Resident Evil thing I've ever tried to do. Right, so let's pop this in. Use that. Still not complete, I know. Couldn't we just put all of it in at once? Would that be okay? We're gonna have to put in every individual piece. Well, that's a bit of a goofy looking line right there, isn't it? No wonder the, um, the guy on the horse wants to kill it. Probably trying to put it out of his misery. Right, I, I tell you what, because that was so antagonizing, I'm gonna save the game again. Because why not? Right. Just so I'd have to do that if, uh, you know, I, I end up dying here, which I'm hoping to not- Bloody hell, Ashley. Which I'm hoping to not do, but, you know, knowing me, it'll probably happen. Right, what do we, uh, especially if there's like- Wait a fucking second. She's not moving. She's fucking floating around me in circle. Look at this shit. I'm guessing you're not supposed to be able to rotate this fast because you're supposed to do it on control. So they probably never considered the fact that you might be using a mouse. And Luke- she doesn't walk around you, she fucking floats. That's- that's weird. What is Ashley? What is she? Is she a wraith? She's- she's not alive, that's for sure. Oh god, another one of these. Where are we going this time? Uh, up and around, all the way into this area. Alright. Well, I think that pretty much completes the entire castle, doesn't it? We're making progress, guys. We're making progress. We need to get all the way to the end of there, and that looks very suspicious, doesn't it? The kind of layout that we got there. Now, if you can only... Oh, she does rotate pretty fast when you've got the knife as well. You can kind of see the motion which she takes. What the f... Okay, wow. I'm not going to look at that any longer. That's creepy. Get on. Or float on. Whatever you choose to do, Ashley. Why doesn't Leon ever question how the fuck she's able to stay behind him so easily? Oh, wow. Reflective flaws? Does she have a reflection, I wonder? No, she doesn't. She's clearly not a, not human. It's it's obvious to me now. Right. So by logic, I shouldn't be able to stab her, but it'll probably happen anyway. I shouldn't really tempt it, should I? Or slasher, should I say? Leon doesn't really stab. He's not a Jill. Definitely not a Jill. Right. Oh god, this is a bit creepy. Don't like paintings. Uh, Wait. Older paintings, should I say, like this. Of, uh... Huh. Why does this look familiar all of a sudden? Fucking hell, it's got something to do with code bloody madman, hasn't it? I think it's one of the rooms from it. Oh, fuck. I'm pretty sure it's got a lot to do with that. I'm pretty sure it's one of the areas that was in it. Yes, it is. It definitely is. Oh, uh, that's not on. That That's really not on. I'm, I, I'm still... Ah... Uh, I'm still fresh from that game, still a little bit tender, you know. What was that? <laughs> 